Okay, I'm making this YouTube video to show you something here. This is a AGM battery that was totally sulfated and what we did was we put it on a supply and flooded the cells. We popped the caps and that's these type caps. And as you can see down in there we flooded these cells so if I shake it a little bit you can see it now what we're using to charge it now is a solar tracker an 80 amp solar tracker and um, you can see we're in the green condition here and this is saying that the sun is, sun has activated the circuits and this one is now very dim but it's desulfating the battery because it's oscillating back and forth so it says it's in a state of charge of green so if we take this off you can hear the tracker go up and I'll show you the panel in a minute and if we load the battery and just let it load with this car light with the bright filaments on we'll just let it sit there and load and uh, you can see here that the current you can pull the current out of the battery now we take this off and then couple the solar tracker back to it you can see there's no green light but watch as this 200 watt panel brings this up and the tracker changes position the green light comes back on them so if we uh, move outside now we've done all these batteries the same way by popping the caps and you can see that we've popped the caps and so they've all been able to be revived by the process that I explained on the internet on the monopole for on the energy science form okay so we go out here you can see the panel and that's the panel that we're using okay it's a 200 watt panel and we're running just this cable in so we're not even in direct sunlight with the panel because the sun is just past my shoulder so, once again, we'll go back over, and you can see that it's in desulfation mode. It says that it's charged, but the solar tracker moves to a position to desulfate the battery. It oscillates back and forth in a pulse charging method. To, uh, to charge this battery and you can see very slightly it's very it's regulated the current down now so that it's just desulfating it so it never boils your battery unless there's something wrong with the battery so you can see here so I just wanted to explain this to you how we revive this AGM battery and we'll test it for time soon and I'll post another video. Thanks for watching.